name is Gabe Zolna. I went for a ride on my motorcycle this afternoon and uh, it does have a sound system, a stereo, and I was listening to Rush. And he was talking about um, the Speaker of the House, John Boner, who uh, apparently had said that, uh, you know, the Obamacare is the law of the land and um, we've got to deal with it. Well, I beg to differ, John. And the reason I beg to differ, John, is because the House of Representatives control what? They control the purse strings. That's what. Now, if I'm not mistaken, the Supreme Court, Justice Roberts, agreed that Obamacare can stay and remain because it's a what? Well, he said it's a tax. Now, who's responsible, John, for a tax? Guess what, John? The House of Representatives is responsible for a tax. But maybe you weren't even aware of that because you were too busy with your pharmaceutical lobbyists. John, isn't that where you made like, uh, what is it, $2.8 million in pharmaceutical stock? I don't know. Maybe that's why you got confused. The responsibility for the House of Representatives is taxation. Period. Now, if you're not aware of that, look it up. The House of Representatives holds the purse strings. Now, the Senate can't do anything without money. And you guys control the money. Now, i got to admit, since you don't seem to be in touch with what's going on, John, uh, maybe there's got to be, like, somebody else to take your spot. Because your obligation is to the American people, not to the pharmaceutical company, not to the people that you were representing or they were representing you. All right? You need to look after the American people. They're the ones that are paying your exorbitant $225,000 a year salary for the limited amount of time you guys work. That's insane. But that's a whole different kettle of fish, John. John, this has to be taken up again by the House of Representatives. They've got to recognize, because you didn't, they have to recognize that they control the purse strings. And you know what? You can starve Obamacare out of existence. The Supreme Court Justice, John Roberts, said it's a tax. That's why it can stay. Well, you guys are responsible for the tax. Not Obama, not the Senate, not Harry Reid, not Nancy Pelosi. Remember what Nancy Pelosi said? We've got to sign this. We've got to sign this so we can read and learn what's in it. How insane is that? How insane is that? Huh? So, John, my recommendation to you would be go talk to your legal counsel boys and see if we can starve Obamacare out of existence. All right? Because without money, they can't do squat. Anyway, it's really, really sad that you as the representative, Speaker of the House, Speaker of the House, you just rolled up your tent and said, we're defeated. Well, you know what? The American people don't believe that. We don't have the cushy job you have. We don't have the retirement plan that you and your fellow senators and congressmen have. We don't have the health care plan that you and your congressmen and your senators have. Okay? Guys like me that are, you know, on in years, we're going to be facing a death panel in 2014. So it has to end, John. All right, John? Thanks.